Hey, what is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel once again. It is Tuesday, so we're gonna be checking to see what's going on with Red Dead Online. So we are just a couple days now, technically calendar year, into the summer. So we really shouldn't have expected anything this week for the summer update, which we didn't get. So just throwing that out there. So now as the weeks come, we are one week closer, but we're also one week farther away from the summer update. And we're going to have, you know, the early one, which is going to be a smaller one from what it seems like. And then a larger one that has the robberies and stuff later in the summer, probably around July and September. So let's just get into what we do have this week. Now, the big questions that people always ask, is there any bonuses on Trader or Moonshine? No, there is not. So just throwing those out there real quick at the first part. But let's just jump into it and start right here at camp. So if you go ahead and go over to Wilderness Outfitters that you have in your camp, and you go ahead and pull up the menu and as soon as you get into here you will see everything is on discount except for the trader table itself so the themes the tents the flags equipment dogs and crypts outfits you have discounts on all these different items and while you're in camp go ahead and get your madame czar weekly collection list it is for you know the royalty one you got earrings you got diamond earrings again and tarot card so yeah emerald diamond earrings and uh, queen of swords tarot card now this week they've brought back once again all fast traveling is free so whether it's through your camp or any of the towns it is absolutely free great time to use your treasure maps because you bounce all around and you know collect a roll stuff if you have the gene rookie map you're going to make a lot of money and you're going to save it a lot of money because you're not going to spend jumping all around the map specifically if you do what i do i'll go for the coins and things like that and you know just get the other stuff while you're there now, if you head over to this stable, as you're going to see, there's a discount on all the variants of the war horses. So no matter which one it is, there's discounts on all of those. And while you're over there, if you go ahead and check out the vehicles and stuff, you're going to see that there's discounts on wagon liveries as well. And if you pull out your catalog, you'll see there's discounts on the pistols. So that's the volcanic, the semi-automatic and the Mauser. Really good discount on all those. Now, also with the pistols, the Bounty Hunter variants of those are on discount if you head over to the Gunsmith. You can get the variants for those that are on sale as well. And if you check out all the tonics, the uh, Health Cure, Snake Oil, those are all 30% off. Really good discount on those because these are really expensive. And if you do PVP, you know you can easily go through $1,000 a day just doing that so definitely stock up on those and make sure to stock up on these again monday night before the update you know changes over and you know go ahead and fill up your camp and your post office so you can pick those up later on now this week all roll clothing is on discount really good discount on those but they do these so often you probably already have these outfits if you really care to get them but every roll all the discounts are for those but specifically we're going to be looking at the bounty hunter because it seems like this week is going to be kind of a highlight on the bounty hunter role. So of course the outfits are on discount, you know, the I'm watching you emote, you know, you got to have that. Um, and then, you know, the gun belt, the holster, the other emote, um, the other variants of gun belt and holster as well. So um, yeah, definitely more likely this week, we'll probably have some bonuses on bounty hunter uh, XP or money. So if you've done a bounty hunter uh, mission, just go ahead and let me know down in the comments. I never really like those too much because yes, you can get good gold for those, but you have to put a 12 minute timer on it and you're just sitting around in the towns waiting to get shot. So yeah, it's not one of the better ones, but more than likely that's probably what's gonna come out later in the newswire. And this week too, there is no limited stock clothing, which it should be limited stock, not coming back in every few weeks. But there is no limited stock clothing this week, and that is basically all we have for discounts on clothing. Now, if you head over to the barber shop, any of the hairdos, any of the beards, teeth, all that stuff looks to be about 50% off. So, yeah, they're not really expensive anyway. Even some of the gold ones are on discount too. So, if you really want to pay gold for some of those, you could go and get those today too. And if you head over to Harriet, all of her tonics and animal revivers are on discount this week. Animal Revivers, of course, if you're going to be doing, you know, a lot of the stuff in the naturalist role. Uh, her tonics, I, <laughs> the weight gain and stuff, I, I, I wouldn't really waste my money on them. They're crazy expensive and basically worthless in the game. 
So there is no discounts over at the fence or at Gus that I could see whatsoever and no selling bonuses or anything like that at Gus either. Now, if you go to Madame Nazar, the bounty hunter item she has over there is the same kind of discount percentage. So head over there, you know, it's got like the Kano looking eye patch and stuff like that. Nothing great, but the items she carries are on discount as well. So that looks like what we have this week, guys, for Red Dead Online. Again, check out that newswire later. You know, we'll have probably some of the bonuses and stuff for money and hopefully some gold at least, uh, or probably more likely just XP for the bounty hunter. Uh, but yeah, Newswire might bring some more stuff out. Usually it's nothing great beyond this point if you don't see it in the game right now. It's already in the game, you just haven't seen it. So if you've done any of the bounty hunters, go ahead and let me know down in the comments. Let everybody else know I haven't done one yet. Just because you got to sit there and wait for 12 minutes to even see what it maxes out at anyway. But guys, if you do want to stay up to date with Red Dead Online when the summer update comes out, hit the sub button and turn on bell notifications so you get notified every time I go live or post a video. And if something comes out in the newswire that is newsworthy, I will put another video out for it. But this is what we have this week, guys. So like always, I'll catch you guys next time in the next video.